Welcome to another very exciting episode we've become of Mixology with Marcus. And today, being dry January, we are going to make a dry martini with a twist. So it's a classic dry martini, but with a twist. The trick to any good martini is it's got to be super, super cold. Now, because I'm an amateur and a lot of people making martinis are also amateurs because you're supposed to be making this from home. This is not for bartenders. If you're a bartender, please turn off now. So I'm going double measure of, I'm actually, see I'm shaking, is because it's cold, not because of a hangover. Um, I'm actually gonna go three measures of this, like so. And then as we know, we like our martinis super dry. So a nice dry vermouth, and we'll put in just half of one of those. Like I say, super dry. Now, because of our twist, and we're making my favorite martini in the world ever, some orange bitters, love it. Can't get enough of it. A Couple of dashes of orange bitters, delicious. Stir and taste, it's what this bit is all about. So you want it as cold as you can get it. You want lots and lots and lots of ice. And then you've got to taste as you go because you don't, really, you're not a bartender. You want it really super cold, but you don't want it watery. Hence the Navy strength. There we go. We'll get rid of the ice in our glass. And then we like to double strain because you don't want any bits of ice in your drink. So it's got to be double strained. I'm going to pride myself on my measures. There we go. Like that. Of course, you want a nice garnish. Now, if even I, actually, I don't have a knife here and I don't have time, but even I would normally get your garnish, but then flatten it out on the table and with a very sharp knife, just remove the pith, because the pith can give a, a, a real bitterness to it. Um, and that is a huge garnish, but never mind, we'll be all right. And we'll make it flashy, we'll just twist it around here a little bit. But normally you really want to get rid of that pith, so, but because, this is just for show, like that. And if we give it a nice, good squeeze, we'll get some nice oil from the fruit onto the top of the drink. Martini even. A little twist. And that's it. And you can tell it's super cold, really delicious martini. Stuck to the table, froze to the table. That's really good. That is so good. Just a hint of orange in there with some of the oils floating on the top. Delicious. So dry January, make sure nothing but dry drinks.